Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Wilhelm Scream, and welcome back to another day in Destiny 2 for some more Destiny 2 news and Witch Queen Season of the Haunted Intel. And tomorrow is the weekly reset, so there was just a few things that I wanted to round up for this week, make sure that everybody had the opportunity to take advantage of before tomorrow. Some of these are weapons, some of them are activities that you can use to get weapons, as well as some crazy XP, and some of them are some glitches that allow you to get weapons that you wouldn't normally be able to get. So, we're just going to go through all of them. Before I get into all that information, I just want to remind everybody, I'm still doing the giveaways on my YouTube channel, every thousand subscribers, all you have to do to be entered into any future giveaway is like this video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, turn on the notifications, the bell that's right next to the big red subscribe button, and follow me on Instagram or Twitter. They'll be linked in the description box down below. You can also leave a comment or any of the hashtags listed directly beneath this video in the comment section for another entry into that giveaway for this video. The first thing I wanted to just briefly talk about was a pretty unique weapon being sold today at Banshee 44. The Snorri FR5 fusion rifle. This is a pretty ridiculous range fusion rifle with high impact reserves, firmly planted particle repeater or projection fuse, extended barrel and hammer forge rifling. It also has a range masterwork. Really, really good. Definitely worth a pickup maybe for trials or for the next iron banner. I think this will really be a go-to for me. I'm going to make sure that I get one. The next thing that I wanted to discuss briefly was sort of a reiteration of the video I made yesterday. If you are not playing Trials this week, it's definitely a good day to do it, or it was a good week to do it, but since we only have about a day left before Trials resets, um, there was a pretty big glitch regarding Trials this week. If you have gone flawless in the past, all you needed to do was get seven wins on a card and you were able to actually get Adept Loot, regardless if you went flawless on that particular card. So, if you've gone flawless any time in the past, it is a week to play Trials. Also, some people asked me why I didn't have the loot available it's because i do not own trials on this platform this is on pc i own trials on my console just to clear up a few questions that i saw of people going where is all the loot is that a glitch no it's not a glitch i just don't own it on pc but definitely a good day to play trials and the last thing that I wanted to briefly discuss, also, uh, just quickly, remember that Zur is over here. There was a kind of a weird glitch going on with Zur and uh, one of his legendary weapons. Um, I think it's been fixed, but earlier this weekend, uh, Star in Shadow was just randomly changing its perk role every minute or so. Uh, not happening now, but was sort of an interesting thing earlier uh, this weekend. Remember to get all this loot. If there's anything particular that you want, not a great week for Xur. Um, the last thing uh, that I want to discuss is a really great XP farm. And it, I mean, it is a glitch because it's not supposed to function this way, but um, it's kind of complicated one to really uh, understand. It has to do with the uh, XP streaks in all the main playlists, but this week um, there's an interesting one going on with the streak playlist um, for the Vanguard. Now, if you ever took interest to scroll up to the right hand corner when you're in the Vanguard menu, you can actually see that you'll have a streak of five down at the bottom. You'll also see this at the end of every strike that you play, um, but there is a strange thing going on where once you get to a five streak, it's giving you double XP. So you're getting about 700 XP per run after uh, five, um, well, five strikes played. And that with the Nightfall this week um, also 
is really how you want to use that. I think it might be specific to the Nightfall. Um, but you can run the Nightfall at any difficulty. Um, Hero is fine. Uh, you'll also notice, I think, the Adept Loot was dropping after a 5 streak. So you're getting Adept Loot as well as um, 700 XP per run once you have a 5 streak going from the Nightfall. So that's a really big one. So definitely take advantage of it uh, for the next day or so. I think most people usually play these things one day out of the week, so it's not something that everybody farms all week. So I think this is still a good tip um, with enough time to do it. And that's going to be it for all the information in today's video. Hopefully you found something in this video helpful. Um, one more little added tip if you are looking to run um, this Nightfall, I would suggest bring a solar build, obviously, but also bring the Anarchy because this strike is the Warden of Nothing. There's a lot of arc damage uh, shield enemies in it, and the Anarchy, if you have it, is super, super bugged and does crazy damage. So, um, you know, it's doing like four times the damage that it's supposed to be doing. Uh, so great for arc enemies, great for boss damage as well as AoE, uh, and, you know, you can't beat a glitched weapon. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe to the YouTube channel if you haven't already, and turn on the bell notifications, like I said at the beginning of the video, to be entered into any future giveaways. On this YouTube channel, we do one every thousand subscribers, so we're always getting kind of close to the next one. You never want to miss out. Also remember to leave a comment or a hashtag down below for another entry into that giveaway for this video. Remember, it stacks between all videos, so if you haven't done this on a previous piece of content on this channel, you can always go back, check out another video, and of course, do it again. And as always, I am Wilhelm Scream. I'm going to run through the strike now if you'd like to watch. And as always, we will see you next time.